So let me show you how to draw the uh, hydrogen bond pattern between one water molecule and the four ethanol molecules. Uh, the Marvin sketch I installed was uh, is uh, version 20.11, and you can see here uh, the menu, the uh, toolbar, the status bar, the uh, atoms, and also the uh, periodic uh, table of chemical elements. Now let's start with the uh, water molecule. So Marvin has a library of molecules and functional groups that you can type. And you first thing you need to do is click on the canvas. This is the canvas. Make sure that, that things are working. You're working on the canvas and type H2O. See the mouse uh, that H2O show up on the tip of the mouse. So you click. Uh, the left button of your mouse and you can put multiple water molecule in on the canvas You only need to do one. So what you need to do is press the ESC button on your keyboard Usually this is on the top left of your keyboard. You press ESC then you will exit the uh, uh, Typing mode then the next is to select so for selection you have three different options. Right now we choose the rectangular. So you press left button of your mouse and move around. All the molecules inside that region will be selected. Then you press the delete key on your board, keyboard. You will remove those molecules. Next, you select the, other, the, the single water molecule. You press the right button of your mouse see this uh, expand groups that will expand the functional group of this um, uh, molecule you draw so press expand it became a water molecule with uh, two uh, oh group explicitly uh, displayed and the next one you want to draw four uh, ethanol molecules so that you have to use this draw chain because for the ethanol, we know there's two carbons and one uh, hydroxyl group. So you can draw a, a chain of three um, carbons. You can draw very long. If you are drawing a lipid, this will be very useful. So in this case, you draw three. If you draw four, that's fine. Uh, but let's draw first the four of them. And this one will be extra. You press ESC to exit the mode again. You click this molecule to select this part. You press the delete. So that will make it a three uh, carbon chain again. Now you want to change this methyl group to a hydroxyl group. So you go to the right, press this uh, oxygen. You click the methyl group you want to replace. Left, left the key, uh, left the key of the mouse. Click, click, click. So three, and all the four uh, methyl groups are changed to the hydroxyl group. Now you press ESC again to exit, and now you need, you want to make this OH group or the ethanol to be a explicit uh, hydroxyl group like this with a bond. So. The thing you need to do is click this one, then press right button, and you add a hydrogen bond, right? Uh, hydrogen. So you can do the same for the rest of uh, three molecules. So this is easy, straightforward. Uh, just click right button and add explicit. Now you want to make a hydrogen bond and we know that hydrogen bond is bad is uh, strongest when it's linear now this can be linear and so the thing you need to do is to move uh, the molecule together so when you after you select if you press the uh, space bar on your keyboard it will change between different mode or you, you move this uh, mouse over to the center of the molecule it will also change so this is a rotation mode, this is the selection mode, and this is the move, moving mode. So if you want to move the molecule closer to the water molecule, you move. And when it changes to a wheel, then you can rotate the molecule a little bit. Right? So this is how you move the molecules. 
You can do the same for the rest of the molecules. For example, this is not a good position to make a hydrogen bond. So you turn around of this molecule and you move closer. Do the same for the rest uh, molecules. So for this one, you want a hydrogen bond uh, from the uh, ethanol to the water molecule. The ethanol is working as a donor of the hydrogen bond. So you move this a little bit. The last one is here. You can rotate a little bit and move closer. Now you have all these four well positioned. The next step is to add the hydrogen bond. You can add any bond. So, I mean, this one will be covalent. So in this case, you need to add a, any. Now you, you make sure you select, yeah, just move over. You don't have to click. And after you, it turns green, you click the left button, then move the other end to the other end of the bond. Now you can do the same for the rest of the uh, bond. The first, you move the mouse over. When you move over, it will turn green. And after you have chosen the atom, then you click the left button of your mouse and you move. So this will make another bond and this is the other one. Okay, now this is a stretch of, uh, of one water molecule with uh, for acidal molecules, you can change the, this hydrogen bond to a hash bond, which is more uh, appealing in the looking. And also for some uh, calculation purposes, this is probably the proper one. So you move the mouse over. When it touches this uh, bond, this whole bond will turn green. That means this is selected. If you click the left button, it will change. You can do this for all um, for all of them. Now you have a nice uh, structure of the, of the uh, hydrogen bond between a water molecule and the four ethanol molecules. So this is how you do it.